Hello everyone and welcome to GFTL. I am your host Josh and today we will be looking at a game called Experiment 12. It's entirely free to download so I'll provide links in the description. Uh, I think there's a PC, Mac and Linux build available. But this is a very unusual kind of game. Uh, it's called Experiment 12 because, as you can see here, there are in fact 12 chapters. One by a different um, designer each each time. So I played through the first one by Terry Kavanagh just to you know make sure it works. But aside from that, I really don't know uh, what what to expect from this. Uh, I imagine, as you can see from the pictures, different art styles, maybe a variety of different uh, mechanics. But really, it's I mean some of these guys I've heard of. Some of them I haven't, so it's going to be quite a variety of stuff we're, we're going to be seeing here. So uh, stick with me and I'll play through the whole thing and just, you know, have a laugh or if it's not funny, have a cry, maybe? We'll see. <laughs> chapter 1 by Terry Kavanagh. Okay, Chapter 1 by Terry Kavanagh. There appears to be a timer, timer up in the top left. It's counting down, oh, up to something. Uh, do I press space again? Oh yeah. So from the sound of things, we are under the water. Oh god. Oh god, that's... Your face was so ugly, you broke the screen. And we are apparently feeling unwell. As you can see in the top right. Uh, I don't know what the controls are. Hang on. Oh! Oh god, stuff broke. And we fell through the floor. Um, oh, how did I do this? There we go. These aren't exactly smooth controls. Uh, like, uh, you may know Terry Kavanagh as the designer of Super Hexagon and VVVVVV. But these are, there's no like, uh, variable jump. It's, you press up on the keyboard, he jumps up and then comes back down again. You can't like, press it for longer to go higher. Uh, sort of thing. So, doors. Let's go through them. Oh, no. Press the wrong button there. Uh, jump, jump, jump. And this, if I can't get through there, you will see something very interesting. Hang on. I'm going to time this right. Three, two, one, go. <coughs> Ow! Oh no, I bashed my head on it. Ugh. We fell over. Nauseous. It made us nauseous, and it added some time onto the uh, onto the clock. Go, go, go! There we go. Okay, I found the key to level one security card. Sweet. Okay. So now we're feeling nauseous, and basically, there's something wrong with the bl bloke we're playing because if you get hit, the more you get hit, the more unwell you've. Are, or it tells you you are in the top right. There's another door over here. We don't. I don't suppose we have to go through here. But uh, food, some food. Awesome. I don't know what that's for, but we have food now. Uh, through to level one. Oh. Oh. Oh God, that's grim. So the plug we're playing is really unwell and I have absolutely no idea why. No! Oh god, he falls so slowly. And now he's sick. It adds on time to the clock. But it doesn't stop you from playing. And it gets rid of the obstacles in the room that you died in. Ooh, I can't even believe I got over that one. Nice, okay, alligators. Ah, damn it, I didn't jump. Now we're very sick. I don't I don't know if there's like an end point where you become ill and then die. Or if it just lets you play through it. I think the th main thrust of the experiment was for some kind of narrative. So let's, ooh, medicine. And now we're back to sick. So that was good. Found level two security card. Awesome. So where are we? In some kind of security compound thingy? 
Oh, I made the jump again. I'm really proud of myself. That was... I didn't make that one last time we played it. Ten minutes already. Level two. Okay. Twinkly stuff. More food. I don't know how we use food. I'm pressing the spacebar. Enter. Z-X-C-A-S-D. Oh, W-A-S and D workers. Up, down, left, right keys as well. Oh, avoid that. Get the twinkly thing down there. What is... Oh! Oh, this is the... There's a first person part to it. Like, Doom style. And a variety of... Coloured rooms? I do not understand. I've got to admit it, I just straight up don't know what's going on. So there's a pink room, a green room, a blue room, um, and there seems to be a thing counting down on the left there. Oh no, segmentation fault. Can we find our way to somewhere? Help, abort, critical error. No, <laughs> okay. Everything's going wrong for this bloke. He's not well. Ah! Oh god, very sick now. This man is ill. And I don't know how to help him. Oh god. <laughs> that thing charged. And uh, kind of scared me a bit. Okay. That's pretty easy to avoid. That, one, that was one of the easier things. Terrible documents. There's no time to read about these now. Level 3 security card. Okay, cool. Where are we and why are we sick? I think those are the two most important questions for right now. Um, and also, I, I'd quite like to know if and how each of the people's games tie together. Is this... The inside of an elevator? That's what it looks like to me. Oh, giant room. Chapter complete! Yes! Well, I say yes, but we're very sick, so... Okay. Uh, moving on to chapter two by Ian Schneider. Uh, which looks like it's some kind of poor, got poor signal on his telly from the from the picture there. Okay, chapter two. Let's go. Okay, chapter two. Your legs tremble with something. I didn't read that quick enough. Ah, God. Okay, hang on. The thing is with these things, what's, what are the buttons? Do I click on things? Oh, okay. Oh my God, everything's falling apart. No. What's wrong with my, oh. Every- no! This is- Do I- Okay, so that's weird. That's really weird. If I keep my guy on a wall, everything goes back to kind of normal. Bit shaky, but if I go away from the wall, the whole world falls apart. Hang on. How far- how shattered will this world get? Okay, no, that's that's really screwy and kind of messing with my eyes. Your mind swarms in a thousand directions. Okay, the guy who we are playing is not well. I reckon we're playing the same guy, just like... Okay, we can move faster against the wall as well. Yeah, it's probably the same guy from chapter one as well. Yes, you remember telling them. Tell them what? The story at this point is making absolutely no sense. Um, what's, what's in the middle there? Can we... A sudden vision of coloured trees. Those aren't trees. They are... Tetris blocks that have been on a diet? I don't know. <laughs> okay. Oh, okay. We can move. Oh, we can move. Okay. Oh, and this is in f kind of first person as well. Can I move towards stuff? No? Oh my god, this is... This is trippy. Did I make it out of the trees? Oh, I made it out! Brilliant. Okay, stop falling apart. 
Um, <laughs> okay, that is a really good way of showing nauseousness. Because, like, in my head, I imagine the character, who I assume is that little squ white square, he's holding onto the walls because he's so ill, which help helps him get around. But, you know, he's stumbling about, he's, he gets nauseous when he's away from the wall. He needs it to stabilise himself. You feel as though you are watching yourself from another person's perspective. Okay. Uh, reach the wall. Don't get hit by red stuff. There we go. Okay, we're back on the wall. Stability. We've found stability once again. Ah. Oh. Nice timing if I do say myself. You put the cords in your neck. They meet your heartbeat. What? Oh no! My head is pounding. Oh god. Okay, so I think the general theme of this is that whoever we're playing is seriously ill. But they want you to see the narrative because there's no like fail state so far. You try to express, but, 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 but what? Okay, okay. Uh, more visions. Sudden vision of flight. Interesting. Oh, that's a, the blurred effect. Oh, there's a thing over there. I'm gonna look around quickly. Oh, there's a bigger thing. There's grey pixels, three in that direction, and like more in that direction. Quite a lot more. In, I'm going that way. Off into the distance. Oh, it's getting bigger. Oh God. Okay, so where wherever we are, we're looking at like TV screens or something. Oh wow, that's that really really messes with my head. Like, in terms of storyline and in terms of visual effects. You remember. You remember. You remember. You remember clearly don't remember because I don't know what's going on. My head is pounding. No, I couldn't... I couldn't get past there. I didn't know how to get past that one. You feel as though you are... Sp oh. Oh, no. Pretty unsure of myself here. Trying to get around all of the obstacles. That's really difficult. Okay. Oh no, I, I hit it. You do not read the documents. The documents, are they the ones that we found in the last chapter? Terrible documents. Okay, more visions. A sudden vision of organism. Which organism? Oh, it's all pink. Could be any kind of organism. Oh, is that a tree? That looks like the trippiest tree ever. Or if you were playing, um, Proteus, perhaps? No, this... This first-person perspective is making absolutely no sense. It's like a vision, a memory, half-remembered of something. I'm just so curious about as to what's going on. For seconds, you do not reach. Oh my god. Ooh. My head is pounding. Oh, I messed up again. I'm making this guy so ill by not completing the the levels properly. Smaller than and less aware. No. Ah get it. I should have gone round the other side before trying to get all the way over there. Scraping the window and you found a scratching and scratching... What? A sudden vision of inexplicable image. Now this... This kind of reminds me of some kind of... A, the driving section from Untitled by... Was it Porpentine? Oh god, I can't even remember who was by. I'm just so... messed up right now. My eyes... 
And my brain. <laughs> my brain! All of the... Oh, went the wrong way there. Next to the thing. That's really specific. Okay, hold on to the wall. And Mr. Square Man will be fine. Oh god, I can't get through these obstacles. I'm doing really badly at this. It was like watching... Len... Oh, well. Okay. Oh. Travelling across this room is really bad for me. It... It... I'm just gonna have to go straight across. A sudden vision of... Nothing? This is... It's confusing. Green and pink. Where are we? Where is green and pink? Um, the green is... Oh! No, the pink is it's falling away. That's weird. That's so brain-melting. Ian Snyder, what have you done to me? Oh, the game is breaking. End of chapter two. My word, I am confused. But there are ten chapters left, so hopefully something clarifies it. Chapter 2 by Ian Schneider, that was weird. Chapter 3 by Jack King Spooner, who I can't say I've heard of, so I'm going to look him up after this. Chapter 3. This is going to be interesting. Do we ha Oh god, we're here again. Oh, okay. Oh, this is more... This is more sane. This is much more sane. We actually have a point of reference, like a floor and walls and a window. Uh, okay, let's go into the next room. Uh, ah, is that a nurse? We're ill. Nurse, we are ill, we need help, and we are naked. Can we borrow your clothes? So nice for you to join us. You've been through quite a lot, haven't you? I thought it was best if you rested. You seem in stable condition. Why not get some fresh air? Okay, that's not a bad idea, Miss Nurse Lady. I will do this. The world is full of hang-ups. You are not who you think you are. They were trying to help you. There is no one after you. You are safe with me. What? You aren't making sense. You are making none of the sense. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go past you and outside. Please. Oh. More things to avoid. No. Okay. Ah! Oh god! What the balls was that? Okay, don't cross the kind of fuzzy lines there. Got ya. I won't touch it. Thinks the man with the summer hat. It's not for me, sings the hand man. Hangman with a reckless air. Okay, can we can we get past? Oh no! No, go away! How the hell are we supposed to get past here? I'm going this way. Those kind of weird messed up body things are all Is this like my intestines or something? I know we're ill. Colour of blood. The antithesis of violence and destruction idolized by modern games is the enhancement of the domestic environment. The revo revolution will not be computerized. Fair enough. But what revolution is this? This is a... Makes me feel like my brain is revolting. Oh! Medicine! That, that was a plus sign, so... Medicine, maybe? Okay, doctor lady. You keep on collapsing. You know it's because you are refusing treatment, don't you? It's killing me seeing you do this to yourself. What's wrong with your voice? What's that tattoo, that symbol? I've never seen it before. It was in that book you stole from the hospital. I don't understand. I can't tell you where the book was. Or what the book was. Oh god. There was a crescendo of music there. I don't know what that was for. Ah! Not going that way. 
Hey man, I don't think I'm trying to commit suicide. I think my games are an inquiry, which is what all games are about. Who are you inquiring with, the player? Because the player is currently uh, a tad confused. That's okay though, because it, it interests me. Am I going to have to avoid these things again? No. Well, that's good. I like how there isn't a fail state. That is helpful. When you die, a worm will eat your lips. Okay, creepy. And not helpful. I don't think we're supposed to go that way. No, 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 leave me alone. Okay. Um, oh no, okay, we're gonna get eaten by stuff. Yeah, we did. That's really weird. Ah, okay, I'm gonna try once again to get past this thing, because I think that's where we're supposed to be going. Ah, oh, keep on mistiming it. I think I can get past there. I think I can. No, okay, not trying that again. Where the fuck am I supposed to be going? Ah! Ah, no, 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 no! Not cool, man. Not cool. Can I get past this guy up here? No, I can't. I have to go through here then. Okay. Right, we got past it. Nice, okay. Ah! Balls! I rushed it. I rushed past. Let's try and go on the right hand side this time. Whoop! No, avoid the stuff. Right, we're through. Awesome. No, run away from the horrible things. Is that a vomit bucket? Because I think my character, whoever we are, I think the guy needs it because he is crazy. Oh god, he is crazy. That's like a hand or something growing out of the lady's head. The police have been calling. I wish you'd stay inside like I tell you. I don't know what you're seeing or what you're hearing, but they are deceptions. I know that you won't come back again, but I want you to know that I will have grown to love you and will miss the time we shared. Your body, a hard form of lust. Are we having a, an affair or a fling with the nurse lady? I want to talk to creepy looking t uh, little girl down here. Ah, oh, her eyes and her mouth keep changing. Most people feel helpless at the mercy of their surrounding conditions. Subjected to distractions and destruction, they cannot find existential meaning. I think that's a fair enough point. Ah! Fuck! That, that really shit me up, that did. And I want to talk to this lady as well. The lady that looks like she's from the ring. Oh, your face is pulsing, madam. Your face is pulsing, that is not a good sign. As a pendant to the loss of personal identity and depressionism, depersonalization even, can't read. We see the slogan, after me the flood, the reckless death of the subtle. There's uh, not very much subtle about this, certainly. It's all very clear that this man is physically and emotionally unwell. Ah, 
Ah, fuck me, I really want to get past there. Uh, oh god, now I'm just making stupid mistakes. These things look like piles of poo or colons just rolling around. Oh my god! Could have made this easier. Although... Oh god, no, I buggered it up. Egamriov. Is that...? Oh, game over. Huh. Uh -huh. Okay, so there is a fail state. What happens if we go this way? There's something creepy going on back there. I'm going this way. Oh, the police are outside. What are they doing here? The police have been calling. Again, I love you. That doesn't seem to mean much. Bucket it up. We're still playing the game. I said game over, but we're still playing the game. The government is corrupt. They're watching you through me. The medical facility was trying to change you. Why do you have that tattoo? You aren't paranoid. What? Seems that we're paranoid. We're talking to everyone and they're saying weird stuff. And with a word, your mind has changed. Others know you better than you know yourself. You think you know, but you are lying. Dirty fucking lies. Fuck, fuckity, fuck, fuck. Um, man with beard, the Lord is my shepherd. Where he leads, I may follow. Yea, as I walk in the shadow of television monitors and modems, I shall touch no evil. All is lost. All is lost. Man, this is a depressing game. Lady with no face, talk to me. You must not be afraid anymore. There is only you. You are still inside the confinement ch chamber, breathing in the remedy that will make you better one day. I'm not sure that that's true. Divided we stand, together we fall. Protest matters. Grow your own food. Fuck the government. Trust, trust, trust. Trust funds. Hey, wanna buy a dog? I uh, no. Okay, into your oblivion. End of chapter three. Okay, on to chapter four.